yes, you can also lose fat and you can also build muscle. But for me, you kids that are learning about this stuff, something I didn't have as a kid, peptides. They are freaking amazing. They're the hugest thing right now. Oh, well, think of how much better you kids are going to be than I'm going to be if you just go and resort to taking drugs. Thanks, Michael Hearn. Great job. Great post. And so if you didn't catch that, if you didn't understand what that message was, Michael Hearn wants you to go to Transcend and start taking peptides, which are banned performance enhancing drugs. That's right, peptides, most of which are banned by water. You can't use them in drug tested sports because it's deemed being unnatural. He wants you to take those because, well, he never had those opportunities when he was a kid. And so if you take them, imagine how much better you're going to look than Michael Hearn. After all, Michael Hearn, he doesn't look very good. He's all right, but most of you out there, if you take peptides, imagine just how much better you're going to be. You know, fat loss, recovery, you won't lose your hair, you'll have great skin. So, yay, go to take peptides. And just a quick break, like the video if you liked it and click the subscribe button. I want you to be a subscriber. That's all I ask. Please subscribe, click the like button right now. But I need you guys to be smart about this and work with a company that is guaranteed to bring you the real stuff. Talk to Transcend. My link is right here. And so let's first break this down. Does anyone think that Michael Hearns might have an ulterior motive to encourage you to go to Transcend and take peptides? Perhaps he's paid by them. Perhaps he's sponsored by them. And so when he says these things, can you 100% believe everything he's stating? After all, is he in fact 100% natural? I'm not going to say yes or no. It's up for you to decide. But look at this guy. He's in his 50s. Does anyone believe that this guy is natural? And so if you might potentially be willing to lie about taking performance enhancing drugs in the past or even right now, would you in fact be willing to exaggerate the benefits of these so-called peptides, which are actually drugs? And notice he said the word kids you kids he chose the word kids he didn't say adults of the world who are responsible and can make proper decisions you know with the advice and consent of your doctor you kids that are learning about this stuff something i didn't have as a kid you kids that are learning about this stuff you know your kids you probably don't know about peptides you're just new to the world you're perhaps 15 16 years of age maybe you're even 20 i don't know but well me michael hearn when i was a kid when i I was your age i didn't know about these drugs called peptides and so if you take them imagine how much better you can get than me i didn't get all these advantages of peptides that can burn fat build muscle perhaps make your hair stay longer than last time and so please reach out to them and buy these performance enhancing drugs and so i wanted to learn more about transcend as a company and see what kind of advertisements they what are they actually selling what are these so-called peptides and so be prepared to be shocked it's nick with transcend here okay and so it's nick with transcend here the same company that mike is promoting saying all you kids should go and contact them to buy these drugs that's right peptides are in fact drugs i want to take a minute and talk to you about a great fat loss stack that I have in place that way we could all get shredded for the summertime and so you know you need to get shredded for summer because all you are bulking and cutting you're not main gaining at a healthy body weight like coach Greg preaches that horrible coach Greg guy who preaches main gaining at a healthy body fat percentage you know 15% so you don't have to diet for summer get shredded for summer you're just healthy living your life without body dysmorphia you know, why would I listen to that Coach Greg guy? He makes no sense. It's time to bulk it on. It's summertime. Time to go on a diet. And, of course, buy some drugs, some peptides from Transcend, because, well, let's listen to what they do. And we're all going to want to be looking peeled at the beach. Well, not me. I'm not looking to diet for summer. And not you either if you're main gaining at a healthy body fat percentage, one of which you can be year-round. Well, if you're not and you bulked all winter, now you have to go on a crash diet. Well, here's the answer. One is going to be AOD. Now you can get AOD in a trochee version that's gonna actually dissolve. And so raise your hand if you've ever heard of AOD. Not many hands are being raised. What if I state AOD 9604? Still, not many people know what this is. And you're thinking, oh, it's this brand new drug, brand new peptide. 
It's going to double our rate of burning calories. You know what this is actually? It's fragment 176-191. I spoke about this years ago on my YouTube channel. What's awesome about this product, it is going to directly increase your metabolic rate. That way you are going to burn twice as many calories as you typically would. This is a non-water approved performance enhancing drugs, which will help you to burn more calories. But... Did you hear how much more calories he said it's going to burn? He literally said double. Double the calories you're even going to burn at rest. You are going to burn twice as many calories as you typically would. And so let's take a person's BMR, myself. It's approximately 2,000 calories a day from doing nothing, just sitting there. And so what they've just stated is that if I take the first of three of their transcend peptides, you know, drugs, it's going to double my calories burned. And so that 2,000 becomes 4,000. Raise your hand if you believe that. Everyone who raised your hand, you're a freaking moron. Notice who Mike O'Hearn speaks to directly. Kids, because they're young, impressionable, gullible. They see amazing physiques like Mike O'Hearn and think, wow, I want to look like that natural. Mike O'Hearn did it natural. And if I take these peptides that he didn't even have, I'm going to look better than Mike O'Hearn. And why would they say that? Well, because they're naive and they see crazy transformations. They hear Mike O'Hearn preaching he's natural. He says, you can do it better than me. Why have me as your goal? Do even better. And so there's a one in a billion chance that someone can develop a physique like that natural. And so they try to convince them that, hey, everyone can do it. It's not about your genetics. It's just about hard work. You know, taking your peptides, the right diet training program. And if you do the proper stack, well, you too can do it. After all, The Rock, Chris Hemsworth, Wolverine, all those guys, they're 100% natural, right? And so the reality of this can AOD or FRAG 176-191 actually help you to burn calories? Yes. Can it help you to burn twice as many? Absolutely not. It's a bold-faced lie. It would be like me saying, if you take GO2 max, of which the main ingredient, NMN, has been banned by the FDA, if you take this, which has double-blind placebo-control studies, then it's going to burn double the calories. Just take it, double the calories. You're going to lose weight twice as fast. It would be a lie. Doesn't mean it's not going to improve your cardiovascular fitness and improve your ability to burn more calories faster than last time. But if you say by double, then if you say you're suddenly going to double the calories burned, it's a lie. To me, that's a snake oil salesman. So despite the fact that it can work, you can't lie and say it's going to double the calories burned. And so if I say, hey, try out Ecti Builder. It can help you to build muscle to get stronger. And it's not banned by WADA. It's not a drug. So you can take it. Notice I still don't say kids should take it. Kids shouldn't take anything. It's for adults. Once you've reached your genetic limit, once you've stagnated, you can't make more progress. And so if I say it's going to put on 20 pounds of muscle in a month, it's absolutely incredible. 20 pounds. That would be a lie. Be false advertisement. But if you say what it can actually do, what it likely is going to do, then there's nothing wrong with that. And so there's a big difference between promoting supplements to adults versus kids, as well as a major difference between lying about what the supplements can do and being honest to the population. You are going to burn twice as many calories as you typically would, even at a standstill. No, you're not. How can you sit there and lie and still get a good night of sleep? You know it doesn't double the calories you burn at rest. You know it. And then we're going to add in a great fat loss product called Tesso Fancy. He then goes on another great fat loss product. Oh, Tesso Fancy. Oh, it does the world. It does everything. Increase dopamine. Feel amazing. Oh, my goodness. Tesso Fancy will also give you really good muscle building benefits. Oh, really? It's a fat burner. It gives you great muscle building benefits and increases dopamine. What else does it do? Does it give you a freaking cookbook and actually increase your cognitive performance and increasing your bdnf and dopamine production oh it makes you smarter oh it builds muscle burns fat increases dopamine gives you a freaking cookbook while you're driving so we need to implement in the wolverine healing peptide bpc 157 and so yeah bpc 157 is in fact a healing peptide it can actually work but are we not exaggerating just a little? If you showed this to a kid, remember Michael Hearn says, you kids that are learning about this stuff, something I didn't have as a kid, 
peptides. And then that kid hears, oh, I can recover like Wolverine. What do you think that kid's going to do? Of course, they're going to want to buy it. You've sucked them in. They've heard their hero, Michael Hearn, who's 100% natural, say that it's great. You've discouraged them from getting it on the internet because you need to buy it from us. And then all these people making videos, they're getting a cut of the money. But remember this, aside from the cost of doing these things, do you really think that kids, teenagers, young people need to take these things? Kids shouldn't even be using supplements. They don't need them. But then you market to them saying, you have to get shredded by summer. Really? Do they? Why should they? Why can't they just maintain a healthy body fat percentage? Why does everyone need to get shredded for summer? We're encouraging them to think that they need to have six packs to have single digit body fat, that the leaner the better. Only it's not. Have we told them that if you over diet and get to single digit body fat, most likely their testosterone levels are gonna go down? They're gonna have brain fog, insomnia, be starving all the time, not feel good? That they could potentially develop body dysmorphia or even worse, an eating disorder? No, let's not mention any of that. Let's just promise them the world. Double the fat burning, heal like Wolverine, smarter, burn fat, build muscle. Yay! Let's do drugs called peptides. And so many people say, oh, I don't like Coach Greg. That's a snake oil salesman. He's such a bad guy. Am I really? I simply speak the truth. I tell you my honest opinions, good or bad, about everything. And so, yeah, some of my videos have some drama. There's drama here. But wouldn't you rather know the truth? And so if you want a trusted source of information, someone who's not going to BS you, I'm going to give you the good, the bad, the ugly. If something works, I'm going to say it works. If it doesn't work, I'm going to say it doesn't work. And so yeah, I sell supplements. Look at my backdrop over here. Of course I do. But I don't encourage kids to have to go out and buy these things. I'm not telling you you should all go out and get single digit body fat. And I'm not lying about what the supplements can do. Of course they can work. Are they going to turn you into Mike Ahern? Are you going to look like me if you take them? Absolutely not. I keep preaching halfway to that dream physique. Oh, Coach Greg is so demoralizing. He's so discouraging. He's saying you can't get your dream physique. You can't. Even if you do, you won't be satisfied. Look at Alex Ubeck. Oh, my shoulders and arms, they're small. I don't like how I look. My shoulders look small. They're small. Really? Millions of followers doesn't like how he looks. What about Joe Aesthetics? Incredible shredded physique. He feels like he's a shitty athlete. Why? Because he got second place in his pro qualifying competition. Look at the incredible physique he has. But yet, oh, it's not good enough. I'm a shitty athlete. If Joe Aesthetics is shitty, if Alex Eubank sucks and has small arms and shoulders, what does the rest of the world have? It's getting ridiculous. It's gotten out of hand. It needs to stop. We need to have realistic beauty standards. People need to stop thinking that they don't look good enough, that they're not worthy, that they don't need single digit body fat, and that Chris Bumstead in the offseason is not a dad bod. And so, yeah, I've had enough. You are worthy. There's nothing wrong with trying to be healthy, but healthy is not looking shredded. Healthy is not the images we see on social media. Healthy is healthy, mentally, physically, socially, spiritually, all of it. If you're lacking in one, you're not healthy. Stop putting pressure on yourself to be perfect. Stop comparing yourself to other people and just do the best that you can. 150 minutes cardio a week. Perhaps lift weight two or three times a week if you can. Find a sport that you enjoy, something that you love. Doesn't even need to be a sport. Just move. Make friends, talk to other people, stop staring at your phone from morning till night. Doesn't taking peptides technically make you not natural because even if it's for your health, it's for an end of genius source for a performance benefit. And Mike Horn's response, I'm pretty sure PRP, amino acids, which is peptides or stem cells, may be a no-go for natural competitions. My recommendations out here is for humans to take care of their body. I think your question only is relevant to the 1% of peeps that may walk on stage one time in their life. Great question though. And so is Mike admitting he's only taking PRP? platelet-rich plasma, that he's not taking any other peptides, even though he's promoting the company, that he's not taking AOD, you know, FRAG 176-191, he's not taking that fat-burning peptide. And if he's not, why isn't he? And why would he then recommend kids to do so if he himself is not? Pretty sure if Michael Hearn is not willing to take all of these peptides that he shouldn't be recommending to kids to take things that even he won't take. Let me know in the comment section. What do you think of all this? What do you think? Are you as upset as I am?
Like the video if you liked it, subscribe, click the bell button, comment for the algorithm, watch the bloops. If you want a free diet and training program, it's over 50 freaking pages free. Click the link in the description, first and last name, enter your email address, and voila, you've got it. And don't forget, code Greg, 10% off for the harder than last time clothing line, the harder than last time supplements, the cookbooks, the training books, coaching plans by me and my team, phone consults. Follow me on Instagram, Greg Doucette IP Pro. And until next time, I am out.